guys, today we will make a sandwich that is perfect to make an evening before and take with you to the picnic or to the beach or just have it for lunch. It is the most juiciest and the most moist sandwich and there is a secret for that. So do watch the whole video to see what's the secret to the juiciest and the moistest and the tastiest wet sandwich you would have ever had. Then it's just layers upon layers of intense flavor in this sandwich that is going to absolutely blow your mind. Before we start, please do subscribe to our channel. We have a video coming out every week, so please click the bell icon so you're notified when it does. Now let's go and quickly make some sandwich. Place the red, yellow and green peppers or capsicum in a large bowl along with one aubergine or eggplant. Season with some salt to taste. Toss in 2 tablespoons of olive oil and half a teaspoon of black pepper powder. Mix it all nicely so the vegetables are coated well with the oil, salt and pepper. You can of course use any vegetables as you like here. Now we will grill the vegetables in batches, place them in a single layer on a baking tray and grill in the oven at 180 degrees Celsius until softened and slightly charred turning them time to time. Grilling the vegetables softens the flesh and intensifies their flavour. For the dressing, in a bowl with 2 tablespoons of olive oil with 3 teaspoons of vinegar, 2 cloves of crushed garlic and 1 teaspoon of red chilli flakes. Add this dressing to the vegetables in the bowl. Mix everything together. Leave this to stand for 20 to 30 minutes to allow the vegetables to soak up the dressing. We will now cut the bread loaf horizontally. I'm using my homemade potato and rosemary bread here. This bread tastes absolute best for the sandwich as it is soft and light. Check the link above or in the description for its recipe. If not for this, you can use any bloomer shaped bread of your choice. Scoop out the soft bread from the center, leaving a 2 to 3 cm shell. We will now blitz this cooked out bread to crumbs in a blender. these breadcrumbs to the veggies with the dressing. This is the secret to the most juiciest and the most moist sandwich. This just makes the filling so much more succulent and tastier. Leave to stand for another 20 to 30 minutes to allow the breadcrumbs to soak up all the juices. After the resting time, it's time to layer up our sandwich. Spread the pesto over the cut surface of the loaf. Check the link above or in the description for our flavorful homemade pesto paste. Layer up, starting with mozzarella cheese slice, then a layer of grilled vegetable with breadcrumbs soaked in the dressing. Spread the pesto on the other half of the bread as well. Place two more mozzarella cheese slices. Top this on the other slice of bread. You can have this immediately as well. It tastes so yummy. Look at these layers. It's hard to resist not eating it up. If not, you can wrap this tightly in a cling film and refrigerate it overnight. Take it with you to a picnic or a beach or anywhere else. Unwrap this picnic loaf and cut into thick slices to serve. 
This bread itself has so much flavor in it and it's very easy to make, so do check it out. And every layer that we have put in is packed with so much more flavor and taste, making it a the best wet sandwich. I really hope you try this sandwich because I guarantee you, you are going to love this sandwich more than any other sandwich, even chicken sandwich. Yes, it is that good. Do let us know in the comments how you liked it and do give this video a like if you like the recipe. Also, the link to the absolutely yummy, soft and light potato bread is in the description. Have a great weekend and I will see you very soon. Bye.